In this question, we've got a quadratic equation. x squared plus 4x plus some number k minus 5, that equals 0. And we're told that when we solve this equation, we end up with two equal roots. Now, let's just remind ourselves that when we try to solve the equation ax squared plus bx plus c equals 0, then we get two solutions. We get x equals minus b plus the square root of b squared minus 4ac all over 2a, or the other, the other solution is minus negative b minus b squared, square root of b squared minus 4ac all over 2a. So there's two possible solutions. Now, for there to be equal roots, or only one possible solutions, these two have to be equal. So where we're adding this number and subtracting the same number, the only way for that to happen is if this number, the square root of b squared minus 4ac, is 0. In other words, the thing under the square root sign has to be 0. So that's the condition for equal roots. And remember, this expression, b squared minus 4ac, is the discriminant. That's what it's called. So we're looking at this quadratic expression. Let's compare it with ax squared plus bx plus c equals 0. And let's look at the discriminant. which is b squared minus 4ac. So we've got b. Let's just tie this up. There's b, which is the coefficient of x. b is 4. So we've got 4 squared minus 4 times a. Let's have a look at a. There's 1x squared. So a will be 1 times c. Let's look at c. c is k minus 5. So there's an expression for the discriminant. 4 squared is 16 minus 4 lots of k minus 5. 4 times 1 is just 4. Let's get rid of the brackets, minus 4k, then negative 4 times negative 5 is positive 20. And let's add this 16 and this 20. There's 36 minus 4k. So we've got hold of the discriminant. Now, for there to be equal roots, that discriminant has to equal 0. So we would state that for equal roots, for there to be only one solution in effect, for these two to be the same, this b squared minus 4ac has to be 0. For equal roots, uh, the discriminant equals 0. So that means in this case that 36 minus 4k has to be 0. So let's add 4k to both sides. And let's divide both sides by 4. k is equal to 9. Find the value of k for which that equation has equal roots. The value of k is 9.